Get ready for a day with me in LA with my sister. We're talking full glam. A recipe of watermelon dewdrops. The skin's gotta wake up. Tom Ford eliminating primer. Um, what? Put a beauty faux filter. Kosas skin improving foundation. Mix, mix, mix. I'm really trying to get this video done in one minute. I'm going to Sephora today to get some new products. Let me know what I should get. I'm traveling somewhere very exciting tomorrow. Can anyone guess where? Little hint, it's tropical. Elf 16 hour chemo concealer, obsessed. Also, I'm going to dinner at Elefante tonight. If you've never been, you need to go. Makeup by Mario contour stick, always. If you've been to LA, what's your favorite thing to do here? If you guys are watching this video, where are you from around the world? I feel like all my followers are pretty global, so I'm curious to know where you're from. Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder. I packed this all over. Dior Backstage Bronzer. You already know what this is. Forever Obsessed. Herman Decay Devil Down Brow. Dior Highlighter. Bronzer on the lids. Item Beauty. From Beauty. Kiss Lashes. Ready for the day. Sunday, Riley is literally sending singers to my door right now to deliver their new product. I'm just so excited. Let's go see. Don't cry. That was incredible. And if you ask me why I love my job, it's moments like this. Okay, here she is. Obviously, we need to try it out. I pretty much just woke up, so I definitely need some of this right now. Okay, let's go ahead and take the top off. It already smells incredible. Look at that color. I wish you could smell this right now. So the color apparently is derived from marigolds. This feels amazing. So this is the CEO Afterglow, and it's supposed to supercharge your natural radiance, which it's really doing doing a little massage action here it's infused with vitamin c and a bunch of antioxidants it's also supposed to improve skin texture and brightness in one week look at that glow it's also derived from aloe which i love the afterglow is no joke can you guys guess whose birthday it is it is colourpop's eighth birthday we're celebrating it by kicking off the hashtag colourpop icons challenge i'm going to create an eye look for you guys using their super shock shadows while explaining to you the challenge i just put down a base shade and now we're going to go in the super shock this is the shade at la mesa look at how shimmery okay we're going to go right in it feels so buttery oh so u.s residents can enter on tiktok by posting an artistry video to their own channel and tagging colourpop going in with shade boutonnerie and shade tassel the winner will get a cash prize of 3500 us dollars you'll get added to color pops pr list for a year and you can custom design a super shock shadow go enter to win are you new here yeah <laughs> get ready with me one dip makeup challenge edition ew what is going on with the hair today obviously i'm a full coverage queen but the natural queen inside me does exist let's start off nice and easy with brows this is the benefit 24 hour brow setter i only dipped it in once easy peasy next one pump of the say star glow okay <laughs> hollywood flawless filter one dip just gonna even out what we have going in to blend elf camo concealer never lets me down time for blush this is pretty easy. Bronzer, one little dot. Looking good. Little dip. Mascara, one swipe. Definitely a little sparse, but she slayed. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to achieve Alicia Keys' glow. You guys, we cannot lie, we all know Alicia has the best glow in the game. Alicia's brand, Keys Soul Care, has expanded into color offerings. Do you already know? We're doing a fun and flirty look today. Remember what I tell you guys, don't forget to moisturize. Let's start with the Illuminating Serum to hydrate and prime the skin. This product has been selling out like crazy, and I'm not surprised. Now time for the sheer cheek tint. You're gonna wanna see this. Look at how beautiful this is in the shade Awakened. This is so gorgeous and it's such a natural color. I love applying a little bit of blush to the eyelids as well. I use the Keys Natural Flush Cheek Brush and it's so seamless blending. This cheek tint is so nourishing, in love. Time for brows with the Soft Brow Gel. This is not crunchy, it's conditioning, love it. This sheer lip balm, to die for. So hydrating, I'll be back with the final look. And here we have the Alicia Glow. Part two of getting ready using products I've never used before. For a face of products we've never used before until now, we're looking pretty good. Going in with a Givenchy Prism Liber Powder in shade one. Ooh, colorful. Let's go right in. I'm a little nervous about this one. It's the Refai Water-Based Powder. The consistency is so strange. Okay, it's wet. It's I'm kind of confused because now my face is just wet. It's not set. 
Is it supposed to dry? Going in with this Urban Decay, the ultimate brush off. <laughs> I think I used too much. Going in with the One Size Bronzer Trio. Why are there so many sirens right now? Wow, she is pigmented. Going in with the One Size Blush. Ooh, Patrick knows what he's doing. Go to part three. Part three of getting ready using makeup products I've never used before. I mean, your girl's looking pretty snatched. Going in with the Simpsons Revolution Highlighter. <gasps> Ooh, I love this. For brows, we're going in with the Wonder Whip Pink Honey. It smells delicious. I literally smell everything. Oh, um, what? This is hands down my new favorite brow product. You can call me Miss Snatch from now on. I've been wanting to try this for the longest time. I don't even want to touch it. It's so perfect. Starting with this blue color. I am so over these police sirens right now. Excuse me, what? Go buy this right now. Now we're trying the Fenty Beauty Full Frontal Mascara. Ooh, she gave us some volume. I'm trying the Wet n Wild Care Bear Lashes. These are pretty. Okay, cute. Trying the ColourPop Lippy Pencil. And Beauty Matte Lipstick. Love. Kosas Plumping Gloss. Yes to every single product. Quite a bit of you had a lot to say about my last review. I'm all about second chances though, so let's give it another shot. I was feeling a full glam moment yesterday, but I guess this is a tinted bomb. Here she is. We're going in with a tiny bit. Okay, let's buff this out. I really don't see anything. Let's go in with more. This is the side with and this is without. To be honest, I really don't even see a slight difference. The smell is also very overpowering. Do you guys see a difference? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Um, you're probably asking me, Meredith, what is this? Well, to be honest, I'm not really sure, but we're gonna find out. So Jones Road came out with this and it's called What the Foundation. I think that's a fair name. The hair's gotta go up for this bad boy. I'm excited. I got two shades, light and porcelain. You know me and my hands, so let's just go right in. Smells very strong, let's apply. I mean, I am the foundation queen, so... I'm not sure what to make of this consistency. My hands can't, um, what's going on here? You guys, I'm really trying. It's gonna be a no for me. I really wanted to like this though. You guys are gonna wanna see this. I mean, did you really expect anything less than Miss Dior? No, you didn't. This is the Dior Backstage Face and Body Glow. I think you're gonna wanna remember that. You're like, just stop talking and put the product on already. The shade I'm gonna be using is 001 Universal. Shake that bad boy up. Okay, let's go right in, you guys. Oh, liquid gold, literally. Do a pinch here and a pinch here. Now we blend. You guys, this stuff is seriously amazing. Oh my god. Oh, I'm blinding you? I'm so sorry. Dior claims that this is makeup artist's secret weapon, creating a subtle, luminous complexion from the most natural to the most intense. I mean, your girl chose the most intense. Let me go finish this look off, and I'll be right back. Run. Do not walk. You know, I just casually dipped myself in gold today. I literally... I don't know what to say. Get ready with me, natural makeup edition. I know, everyone's favorite. Hydration is key, people. Never miss a day. You guys, I'm going to an Alesso concert tonight, and I'm pretty excited. This is what we're working out of today, if anyone was wondering. Starting with Hollywood Flawless Filter, because obviously, blend that bad boy out. Okay, wow, Gorge, going in with Giorgio Armani Concealer. A little too dark, going in with this YSL Radiant Touch-Up thing. Blend. Ew, I'm never singing again. Time for contour. You guys know the vibes. Makeup by Mario, obviously. Do you guys prefer natural or full glam on me? You already know my answer. Let's tame these things. Wait, I just had an idea. Oh my god, yes. Curl, curl, curl. You guys, wait one moment. Like POV. Hi, nice to meet you. Oh, hey, item beauty. Miss Charlotte. And there you have it. Get ready with me to meet Alicia Keys. Honestly, I'm still processing that this is happening. I just can't believe it. Going in with the Tom Ford primer. If you were to tell me a year ago that I'm meeting Alicia Keys, I'd say, no, you're crazy. The fact that I'm so hungover right now is... I can't. 
But guess what? We don't have time to be hungover. We're literally meeting Alicia Keys. I think I've said I'm meeting Alicia Keys probably 15 times now. I'm sorry. Yep, we're looking a little scary right now. We gotta blend this out. Hollywood flawless filter on the neck because why not? Elf 16 hour camo concealer. Alicia Keys is such an inspiration to me and I'm sure many others. So this day is super special. What do you guys want me to ask Alicia? Let me know. Like every time I listen to Empire State of Mind, I just... I can't even explain. Um, hello, Miss Blush. Laura Mercier powder, obviously. Round of applause for the powder. Under eye bag, gone. Go to part two. Part two of getting ready to meet Alicia Keys. Yep, you heard that right. Miss Dior. Um, I'm still blown away at the fact of meeting Alicia Keys. Like, how does one prepare for a moment like this? Yes, we're bringing the iconic blush out. Oh my god. I can't tell if I'm shaking because I'm hungover or because I'm meeting Alicia Keys. I don't think you guys are ready for this highlighter. The highlighter is stealing the spotlight. We need to take a second. Okay, let's fix these brows. Urban Decay Double Down Brow. Um, by the way, did you guys see Alicia's dress at the Met? Quite literally iconic. Setting those bad boys with the Benefit Brow Setter. Yes, I know you want this off my lips immediately. Is it normal for my lips to be this pigmented? Dior bronzer on the lids. Natasha Denona Pastel Palette in the inner corner. Your girl's got a curl. Mascara, liner, lipstick, lash. Time to go meet Alicia Keys. Good morning. Yes, we did a horrible thing and slept in our makeup. I'm gonna give you a rundown of the Met Gala after party while I take this off. Just beware, I'm very hungover. I'm meeting Alicia Keys today, so the hair has to stay perfect. Going in with our glow recipe, papaya sorbet bomb. So the Met Gala after party. I saw Cardi B. She is just as beautiful in person. I saw Billie Eilish's brother, Phineas. I saw Dove Cameron. She is so beautiful. I cannot see a thing right now, so I'll be right back. Going in with the Shiseido cleansing foam. This stuff is so good. I'm going to insert a clip of Cardi B from last night. Iconic, am I right? Going in with this peach and lily essence. Peach and Lily matcha pudding. No, but last night was seriously amazing. And that is my hungover skincare routine. Did someone say Charlotte Tilbury is launching a new product? Well, I'm going to be the first to tell you what it is. Here I present to you the new Charlotte Tilbury Cream Bronzer. So I was very lucky enough to get my hands on this before it launched. You can literally see it's a sample. So let me show you inside. I have used it a few times, but look at this consistency. This is the creamiest, most buttery consistency. I'm sure you guys want to know what it looks like. So here we go. We're going in. Like, are you kidding me? This is so beautifully pigmented and blends out so nicely. This product launches very soon, so you want to be sure to join the wait list. Here is the before with nothing, and here is the after. So I'm going to finish off blending, and I'll be back with the final look. She is snatch. You guys, I love this bronzer. Go join the wait list. Let's review the Pat McGrath Glitter Lip Kit. Pat McGrath is an icon. Let's just start with that. The packaging though, it's so beautiful. I don't want to touch it, but let's open it up. Here we have the instructions. We have three products, the matte lipstick, the gloss, and the glitter. It says to start with the lipstick, so here we go. Ooh, she is pigmented. This color, the instructions say to pat the glitter right on top. <gasps> Oh my god. She is looking spicy. Now it says to add the gloss. <gasps> Meredith, can you please tell us what's going on here? Don't mind if I do. This is one of my favorite products. This is the Wishful Chin Lift. I mean, who doesn't love a Snatch Queen? Let's go ahead and open her right up. She's meant to lift. She's meant to sculpt. She's meant to do it all. You guys already know, I love to know what my products smell like. And that's one of my favorite things about this. It smells like peppermint. Oh my god. Okay, let's go ahead and review this. I'm going to take this plastic film off the top. So satisfying. Oh my god. Okay, we're going to start at the chin and we're going to pull up like so and tuck it behind the ears. Okay, she's applied. It gives a really nice cooling effect from the peppermint, which I love. It says to leave on for 20 to 30 minutes, so I'll be right back. All right, we're back. It's been about 25 minutes. Okay, I'm gonna start it this year. You guys, what do we think? I think she's looking lifted and snatched. Love, love, love.
Get ready for a meeting with me, I have in less than 10 minutes. You guys are probably thinking, how can a full coverage queen get ready in less than 10 minutes? But today, I'm gonna show you how. I'm gonna be using the Charlotte Tilbury Quick and Easy Kit. Like, look at how convenient this is. And I start with the Easy Eye Wand. This is in shade Super Chic Eyes. Oh my god, look at the difference. Now that we scribbled that on, time for lip and cheek. You guys, this is so easy. Pop some of this onto the lips. Last but not least, we need some highlighter. Okay, wow. Literally so easy. Time to go ahead to the meeting. 